friends, welcome. I have a fun mini book flip through, so let's get started. This is using the Halloween mini album from Scrabbadoo Designs, and it does come with the letters that spell out Halloween. Here we go. And it comes with three layers, so it's the words, the outline of the paper that comes with the stitching, and then the outer piece, which would be the cover. So let's get started. I did make it a bit more towards Thanksgiving theme because I wanted to show that you don't only need to use it for Halloween. You can use it as a book. It has a really great shape and it's a really good size. So that's why I'm using today. It does come with the three holes right here to be able to add, you know, the, the, the hinges, the loops, the threads, the whatever you want to hold the book together with. So let's get started. I used Hello and it is wrapped in simple uh, orange thread on one side right here. And that is so fun because the word, it's supposed to say Hello. So if I just change the A to the E, it says Hello. And I'm using the word Pumpkin. And this fun word is actually from Scrap Diva Designs. I'll go through and share with you what I did use. It's from the Hey There uh, Pumpkin, the large one. So you can see I used it on that. And this pumpkin right here, also Scrap Diva, it's the pumpkin album, mini album. So go through your dies that can be um, used for the, the season and it fits in perfectly right here. I just added this tool shimmery bow and let's get started. Also, I am using a paper pad that I have found at um, Michael's and it drew me because it was really pretty it's the sweet harvest and it's really pretty and I I really liked it this was my inspiration for the book so it has of course lots of pretty colors in there and like I said I picked that up at Michaels okay let's get into it so this book is mainly inspired by these little mice and they're kind of adventures in in um, what they get themselves into during the fall. And I will only point out certain dyes and you know, other than that, I wanna stick to um, sharing the book with you. Look at these cute little images. I did color um, these images in the same color combos and I thought it was really cute. I had a lot of fun sticking to a color palette other than um, traditional like brown just browns I loved the pop of pink in there it gave it a very soft look this little guy here floating on the leaf and of course I can't you can't do fall colors without the word fall colors and that is from the fall leaf mini album by scrap diva it does come with welcome fall colors and you could see that it comes with the outline so that's fun to use it on there as well and I these are the Capsilla leaves. I love them from Scrab Diva. They're one of my favorite ones and I use them in this dress form and just kind of like a ombre, almost acorn kind of colors right here. That is so cute and so fun. And it's a dress form so I love it. And these little mice are enjoying the, um, the dress form. Okay. This next one, it, I used the Halloween pocket tag right here this is again scrap diva you don't have to use only for halloween you can alter it so that's a lot of fun and i have these little embellishments here and they are from the memory decks envelope let me share that with you it's this die right here look at these and the flowers of course scrap diva has a plethora of flowers so that's where these flowers are coming from she has lots of uh flower plates and just amazing flowers that you can pick from that's what that's from and then these leaves this one right here also from the pumpkin uh, that she has mini album super cute there we go and then of course pumpkin spice is the thing and these little mice are kind of ready for the pumpkin spice they're already in it and here we have this truck and this comes from the truck mini album like i said mix and match your dies the mice again they're on the the truck 
with their pumpkins and then the word grateful again this was just from last season the grateful word scrap diva and it's so cute because the truck i loved using the paper to um add that kind of uh pattern on it it was really cute i love it this little guy's peeking out okay next page they're all in their pumpkin patch and they're looking at all the different cute little pumpkins that they want to pick using the thankful word from scrap diva again the pop of colors that this brings is so much fun and last but not least again more flowers by scrap diva and the sunflower the sunflower dye this is a sunflower uh, bag topper one the small one so it's really pretty and i I love the different kinds of pinks. The video doesn't do it justice, but this pumpkin right here, a little bit darker, more, a little bit more orangey, is actually glittered. This is just plain pink cardstock. And then of course, the patterned one. Same thing with the sunflower. Some of these are shimmery, some of them are not. And then of course, more flowers. Super cute, it doesn't have to be a um a book with you know embellishments or anything like that you can make a little story out of it i mean i'm sure if i added words as a storytelling portion of this my recipients would love that i think it's super cute thank you guys so much for stopping by and checking that out don't forget to check out in the description the code veronica so you can get your discount and don't don't forget as fast as these dies come in they move out quickly and then you have to wait for the reorder of them. So remember, October's um, release is coming up soon, so you can use that code for that as well. And I hope you found some inspiration and in pulling out some of those old dies or even using stamped images to make a fun book of embellishments or a little storybook. Isn't that cute? I used all different kinds of threads that I had in my stash as well. And I love the texture on these. Thanks guys for stopping by and until next time, 